Happy Solstice and New Year, everybody. This is Abel James, and I'm here because my good Canadian buddy, Brock, asked if I might want to collaborate with him on a little thing. And I said, of course, I love Canadians, and I love you too, Brock. So he asked me, what is a fitness trend you would like to see more of in 2019, as well as what is a trend you'd like to see go away? So let's start with the go away one. How's this? I'd like to see every new diet go away. I think we can all agree at this point that we don't need more diets out there. There are 16 bajillion. What we need is a return to common sense principles, to eating our veggies, to uh, getting in touch with the earth, eating intuitively. We all know how to do these things. It's a matter of putting them into action. So anything that's new that promises all of the solutions to all of your problems, anything that seems to be a magic bullet, just give it a break. You already know the answer. You are your own guru. Now, what would I like to see more of in 2019? Uh, I would love to see more of recreational exercise. What I mean by that is exercise that's fun, that almost doesn't feel like exercise. So as an example, for the past few weeks, I've been waking up before sunrise really early in the morning. And with my dog, uh, we live at 8,000 feet now in Colorado in the Rocky Mountains. We'll hike up or run up to the top of the mountain to see the sunrise, to do some Qigong exercises, kind of like a movie, moving meditation, and then do some meditation as well. So uh, anything that you like to enjoy when you go out there with friends, family, pets, whatever, have fun. Working out doesn't have to be punishing or too intense or ridiculously hard. It can be a blast too. So I'd love to see some more kind of unstructured, just fun and play outdoors preferably in 2019 so look forward to that once again i'm abel james thanks so much for listening and thanks to brock for asking me to do this we'll see you next time happy new year